this is this is Aminike's mom, Jay. And we're doing 100 summer books today. Mm -hmm. So, so Anike's teacher, Miss Ro her name is Miss Ross. She sent home this sheet for the summer. And the sheet says, "Can you read 100 books this summer? Can you?" <laughs> so we're gonna um, go through this list, and we created our video blog where Anika is gonna review some of the books, and we're gonna share pictures and selfies of the location. So we already did on the bed, and next we did next to a dresser, and, and we did it on a soft chair. soft chair, and now we're doing it on a hard chair today. But we're gonna see what else chair could we use? Come on. So we use both these two for, you know? For the high chair. And then today we're also, because we have to get caught up, we're going to use a rocking chair. So we'll have a picture of that one. And another kitchen chair that may or may not be the same as this one. So what's our first book we're going to read? Good question, Mommy. We're going to read Jack and the Beanstalk. And what's our second book? Next to it, we're going to bring, I don't know what it says, but it's like... Keisha Kane and the Very Sweet Tooth. What did you like about this book? That she got her nails done, and she and we are going to see in our next video that what is she, what's going to happen with the story. The last one we're going to be doing is... Uh, don't let Auntie Mabel bless the table. So uh, we will probably come back later with a review or some thoughts about at least one of those books today. It may be one of our books that we read before. So for now, we're going to say goodbye. Bye. We'll see you later. We love reading. This is Anike, and I'm going to be writing. Reviewing. I'm going to reviewing. Thanks, Mommy. You're welcome. The, the Magic Poof. By Stephen Hodge. By Stephen Hodge. Hodges, sorry. Hodges. So what happened is, the Magic Poof was a way... She, the little girl, little girl right here, she was getting red. She got up, and she, I don't know where her mom and dad is, but I'm sure that they are at work. She's going to walk to school. What I liked about the book is what you guys would think, which is he was excited for something. Very exciting. Guess, get, you would guess. Guess what it is. If you think okay. if you think it was picture day, you are right. <laughs> it's picture day today. It's picture day <laughs> for them in their story. So my favorite other favorite part in this story is these two. Because the girl ate breakfast with cereal a a bread with some jelly, jam, mm -hmm. jelly on it. And she with her cereal. Who else eats cereal for breakfast? <laughs> I do. Mm -hmm. Well, the poof didn't know what to do. So, what didn't know what to do? Wait, what, B. <laughs> so, he wanted to be a big ball or a little one. Mm -hmm. And he told his magic, she told his magic poof to just be what, norm, to be normal. But... He he made a frown. <laughs> he wanted to be a bird, see? He wanted to be a cloud. <laughs> Sorry. He wanted to be a big sunflower, which is what she couldn't handle. So this is what happened. He they made it to picture day. The man was getting ready for the next girl for the next student, which is her. So he whis he whispered into his ear, her ear, I mean, something about him. She smiled, and he smiled, and then, click, we don't know what picture it was. 
it would be. And let's see what picture it was. See, the picture was nice. <laughs> With a smile in his eyes. Mm -hmm. That's weird. Right, Mommy? Mm -hmm. Well, that's the end of my favorite. That's the end of the book of the magic poof. Of the magic poof. Do you recommend for other, for other students to read this book, too? Oh, yeah. I forgot to say that. Tell me if you tell us if you liked it, okay? And also, do you if you want the book, go and buy. You can ask someone in your family to buy you this book. It's my. It might be amazing, sir. So it's amazing. So bye, guys. Bye.